What's up guys, my name is Boba Talks and today I'm here to bring you a new Gotham video. So just a couple of days ago the photos for the winter finale were released and I wasn't originally going to do a video about this but seeing as it is the winter finale tomorrow, why not take a little extra look into that episode. So this is just going to be a quick informative video just going over these stills that were released and just doing a little mini breakdown but we also get a really good look at Frank Gordon and a little insight into his character. But as always everybody if you do end up enjoying this video please leave a like as I really appreciate it. Also guys as I was editing this video my artwork finally got done for my channel which is something I haven't told you about because I was actually going to save it for 3k subscribers but honestly this artwork is just so great and I'm so happy with it that I couldn't wait to put it on my channel so you may have already noticed that I've added it onto the channel so stick around to the end of the video to hear more about that and let's get into the photos. So the interesting thing about the new official stills from the episode is that they show us our first look at Jim Gordon's uncle Frank Gordon. As I said at the beginning we also get a little insight into his character too but first let's take a look at the images in order. So in the first image we get a better look at the photo that was leaked a little while ago now of Jerome with his new followers which appear to be in Wayne Manor. And the reason why I'm saying it's in Wayne Manor is because we still see that Alfred is still there. And what we do know is from the promos that he doesn't go with Jerome and Bruce until Alfred, Gordon and Bullock go after him a bit later in the episode. But I'll talk about that in a little bit. And from this photo, we might very well be seeing Bruce, you know, contemplating if he should go or not and probably feeling that he has to go. But it's going to be interesting to see how this actually goes down in the episode. Now, the next two photos seem to be from the same scene and we get a look at Jim having a conversation with Lee. Now, as usual, ever since the death of Mark, it doesn't look like it's going to be a happy conversation between the both of them. But as to what they are discussing, I hope that they talk about the reason as to why Jim did what he did. Because if you've been watching my previous videos, you'll know that I feel like Jim hasn't had enough of a chance to explain his side of the story, at least not on screen that is. And the show hasn't actually shown him, you know, saying that he killed Mario in complete defense of Lee since he was literally about to kill him. So I'd really like the show to address that. Now, as we were talking about just a moment ago, the next couple of photos show Jim Bullock and Alfred at the carnival. Now this is probably happening as Bruce is tied up on that wooden pole we saw in the promo which is in the same room where Jerome has that cannon that he's about to light and the reason why I think that this is happening just before because in the promo we did see that scene get interrupted and I'm thinking that it could be from Alfred, Gordon and Bullock going after Bruce but what we do know is that they don't get to him in time since the scene with the Hall of the Mirrors is still to come. Now funnily enough we see that this photo shows Bruce in a suit and I think this is definitely before Jerome comes to Wayne Manor and perhaps Bruce is going somewhere on a business of sorts but I really am thinking that it is before Jerome takes him since when Jerome does take Bruce he is wearing the typical Bruce Wayne turtleneck. So, so let me know what you think about this photo because I thought that if they do something with Bruce in his suit here before he gets taken they're gonna have to do it pretty quickly because you would have thought the whole carnival stuff with Jerome and Bruce with Bruce wearing his turtleneck would last throughout the whole episode but this photo does indicate it's happening beforehand rather than after the whole thing with Jerome and Bruce because I just don't think that with the way this episode is going to end with that you know fight scene in the white band promo that they would show even more footage of Bruce going out somewhere in a suit. So in this photo we get a really good look at Frank Gordon and judging by the next couple of images I don't think that Jim is really happy to see his face. Now as you see he has got a drink in his hand in his photo and I think in this photo we can see him just before he takes that drink. Probably after rejecting Frank from coming in and talking to him and then he proceeds to pour a drink and think about what just happened. Now Variety gave us that little extra look into Frank Gordon's character by saying Frank Gordon became estranged to Jim after the boy's father died in a car crash but now he is back to reconnect connect with his nephew. Now my personal thoughts are that Frank went to join the Court of Owls maybe or maybe even was a part of them already and perhaps Jim's father's death was somehow involved with the court. But I'm going to save these thoughts for a theory video that will be coming out on the winter break but either way guys I would love to know what you think about this in the comments below. Now in this last image we see that Alfred has got his finger over his mouth and I think that this is pretty obviously indicating to be quiet and that is most likely to Bruce since when this is happening it's most likely going to be just as Jerome and and his followers are coming into Wayne Manor. Either way guys this was just a quick informative video just something to tide you over until the winter finale airs tomorrow. Let me know what you thought of these photos and as always let me know if you have any new theories based on them. And you may actually recognize the artwork as well from the artist Mrs. Van Dam. She's responsible for all those Gotham artwork pieces you see sometimes in the videos. Be sure to check her out the links to her Tumblr and her Twitter are down below. And I just hope you guys love it as much
much as I do. Not long until the final episode airs, guys, and a lot of stuff is going to be explained in this episode, so let's get some hype because there really isn't long to wait. But ultimately, everybody, thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a lovely weekend, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.